Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm gonna give you a tour and an overview of our laundry room. Um, when you first come in our laundry room, I just entered the door in from our um, family room. And then, then we have this door back here that leads to the um, our garage, which is the door we typically go in. But I never, this is the first time I've actually had a laundry room. I did not have a laundry room in our old house. My, our laundry was in our garage. So I am so excited to just have a space designated for laundry. And it, as you can see, I also use it for um, like a mud room type area. So when you first come into the laundry area, we have this sign up here that says, do all things with love. Um, a side note, our color on our wall, the trim is all in white, but our color is um, cocoa. And it's this pretty tan color and I just love it. And it's all throughout my house. So this sign is actually from Kohl's. I got it from another teacher. If you're new to my channel, I am a teacher, but I'm just, got promoted up to like administrative type job so but yeah I got this from one of the other fellow teachers so she got that from Kohl's for me I thought in the laundry room I mean laundry is not the best job to do but you should do it with a little love and then we have this coat rack if you're old to my channel I had this in our family room at the old house but I thought I would put it here and it is from an Etsy shop. It is like real barn wood. It took forever for them to get it to me. But I have that and you can see we have our stuff hung on it. My husband's hat, my purse, and my diaper bag. I have a diaper bag video. I will link it down um, in the description box of what I keep in there. And then we also have this little, um, this is from Home goods. It's this little tub and we, I don't have shoes in the house, so we throw all of our shoes in here. So yeah, it's a big old tub and it usually gets filled by the end of the, by the end of the week. this other side we not when we're doing laundry of course but we keep my dog's crate in here and we order that off of Amazon so when we go to work and my kids go to school we have the dog in this crate right here so we keep that there and then make it over to our washing machine I had the same washers for like over 10 years and they were not high-tech or anything so I'm so excited to have these Maytag um, this dryer and washer they're front load so front load washers you need to always have it cracked a little bit to um, keep it from being stinky and smelling but we got the pedestals to go with them so I store like laundry detergent and laundry type things in those and I have my washer and my dryer are both on a pedestal but I love these these are so nice so nice and with the pedestals it makes them super high and like this does close but you should keep it open um, the pedestals keep them nice and high so I literally don't even have to bend over I can just put everything in and it's perfect so let's oh and on the floor I have this laundry good clean fun and this color you'll see throughout my house it's my favorite color ever but um, I got this from Aldi, and I love it. It's super cute. They had this one and a black one, but I chose this one because it was my favorite color. And then over here, I keep a laundry basket always, just so that I can throw in things. And I got this from Aldi, and we actually have these in everybody's room in the house. Everybody has their own, and we have one down here just to throw things from the kitchen in there or you know towels and such but I always keep a laundry basket in my laundry room and then up here we have um, these hangers they are from home goods they're in that my favorite color um, they I have Brooklyn swimsuit hanging on there I don't know about you guys but I like if she goes to swim in the pool I just leave it to air dry I don't wash it every time she has on like a diaper 
it's fine. But I don't know, I always do that. But I have her swimsuit hanging there with these hangers. So anything that needs to be hung, because I have one of those nifty, those wire racks that you'll find in everybody's laundry room. But I'm like, oh, I can hang our things from there that need to be hung up. So that's perfect. And then on my wire rack, I have one big basket. Like I said, most of my laundry, the stuff that I use for the laundry is kept down below. Um, but I have this basket of cleaning products and I got this basket from, um, where did I get this one from? I, I got this basket from Big Lots and it was like $5.50 and it's heavy duty. I wanted the plastic because if any of my cleaning supplies spilled in there, you can easily rinse it out. And then I have an extra laundry detergent up here. The other ones in the other laundry type things are kept below. Um, I keep my paper towels out. I was gonna get a basket for them, but I kind of like the pop of white against my cocoa walls. And then toilet tissue. And I don't have a ton of cleaning supplies up here because I have underneath my sink and then all of the bathrooms, and then I have a like a little hall area, a little cabinet in my hall area upstairs, and I keep cleaning things in there too. Same thing with the paper towels and the toilet tissues. All of these are located in each of the bathrooms, and this is just the extra overflow that's not underneath all of the sinks. And then we have this container that I got from Amazon. It's like ant proof and rodent proof, so we got that, that has our dog food in there, and those are those same labels. If you haven't seen my cupboard organization video, go check it out. I will link it up there in the cards and down in the description bar. And then I have this from Home Goods. It just has my dog's like extra toys that, that aren't out in the house. And then, yes, I dress him in clothes. So it has like clothes and Halloween costumes and all those good things. And then that is his, so if he, the night with my in-laws or we're going up to the cabin um, he has that's his like overnight bag so we just keep it in the garage but yeah that is my little shelf in this area how I organize it pretty easy we did have our broom on a hook but Brooklyn kept taking it down so I like hide it back here but there's also a step ladder and then a trash can to put all of those, um, the lint. Our, our dryer like makes you clean it out. It like won't go, it prompts you, it flashes a light at you to clean out the lint um, drawer. So we have that there. And that is pretty much it. So that is an overview of our laundry area. I absolutely love it. Um, it's super duper organized and just really functional and it's the best. And I've never had a laundry room so I'm super excited. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Um, lots more organizational videos are going to be coming your way. So stay tuned and I will see you in my next one.